Tonight, Jefferson County School Board members just wrapped up a special meeting to talk about a solution for Jefferson Elementary School. We have told you about the issues, including asbestos, mold, lack of air conditioning, and safety concerns at the school, which was built back in 1958. Well, now parents and teachers have started a movement to get a safe place to work and learn. 10 News reporter Olivia Degg joining us live to update what happened at this meeting. The goal is to find some way to move forward with this school. John Brittany, that's right. They did actually make a decision tonight. The school board voted five to one to approve money out of the general fund for a cost estimate to renovate Jefferson Elementary School. Now that renovation will cost $75,000. Excuse me, the estimate for the renovation will cost $75,000 that will come out of the general fund. And the hope is once they get an estimate, they can take that to county commission and keep the ball rolling. Now, this is an ongoing discussion at Jefferson Elementary School. It has been for years. Should they rebuild the school or should they renovate it? And right now, parents are asking for an immediate but temporary solution, which is to move these students out of the current building. They've discussed portable classrooms, moving students to the Patriot Academy. There's even been talks about moving students to a local church. But again, regardless of the decision, County Commission and the school board are going to have to come together to find the money and approve it for some sort of solution whether that is the renovation or rebuilding a brand new Jefferson Elementary School. That cost estimate for a new school was around $27 million at the last school board meeting. All right, Olivia, so they've made this decision about the estimate tonight. So what comes next? So the next time that the school board will meet for a regular meeting is next Thursday and Tommy Arnold has to come up with a plan and a cost estimate for how to get those students out of the building. And then the county commission, which only meets four times a year, will be voting in three weeks. Uh, they'll be meeting in three weeks to uh, discuss this. I'm not sure if it's on the agenda yet, but we will keep you posted. More to come. Olivia Degg with the update from Jefferson County.